My name is Roy Dean. I started training in Jiu Jitsu when I was 16 years old. I went to Japan as an exchange student and I started training in Judo. After I came back to the United States, I continued my training in Aikido, then Japanese Jiu Jitsu, and then eventually Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. And I've been doing Jiu Jitsu for over 25 years now. I think Jiu Jitsu is a flexible technology, a human technology, that allows you to solve many kinds of problems. So, in the past, they emphasized self-defense, um, but Jiu-Jitsu has also been uh, solving problems against edged weapons, against swords, against multiple opponents. There are all kinds of approaches in Jiu-Jitsu, and there's room for all of these approaches. Now, when it comes to um, self-defense, those show you possible um, angles and movement patterns against certain attacks. However, the more modern jujitsu is geared toward competition, which is good, but these are very sophisticated answers for problems that don't exist in the real world, only in the field of play on the competition mat. So they're good answers, but don't confuse the complicated answers for simple answers uh, that you may not be able to use. What really made me fall in love with Brazilian Jiu Jitsu is the fact that many martial arts talked about a smaller man being able to beat a bigger man consistently, but I had never actually seen it happen except in Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. In Brazilian Jiu Jitsu they could prove it over and over again and I decided I want to be able to do that too. I don't feel that you're ever too old to learn jiu-jitsu. I have people that I know that started in their 40s, that started in their 50s, and they continue to train to this day. Many of them earning black belts. It's important to find the right training environment and the right kind of instructor that can temper the training and adjust it for you at that time. But once you find the right teacher, you'll be able to continue on the jiu-jitsu journey for the rest of your life. Time, new partners. Switch it up. Jiu-jitsu will always be effective. Now, people may become more educated and have answers to how to thwart jiu-jitsu, but jiu-jitsu is a human technology that allows people to solve problems in every age against any kind of weapon against any kind of hand-to-hand -hand, um, tactics. It will continue to be relevant. Jiu-Jitsu is adaptive and flexible, and it will continue to be as it is today. Women are the ideal audience for Jiu-Jitsu. Because they're physically weaker, they need to understand how to use their body to achieve leverage and be able to overcome a stronger and more athletic opponent. Jiu-Jitsu is well-suited for women. I would like to thank my teachers, in particular, my Brazilian Jiu Jitsu teacher, Roy Harris, and my Japanese Jiu Jitsu teacher, Julio Toribio. These are good men, great martial artists, that have given me the opportunity to share my knowledge with the world, and I'm very grateful that they guided me on this path. I love Kuwait. I love the people, they're very warm, they're accepting, they're welcoming, the food is delicious, and I have to say that coming to Kuwait has given me a new respect for Islam, truly a religion of peace, and I'm grateful for the opportunity. Thank you for having me.